Hello everyone, thank you for making up your time to listen to my presentation. I'll be talking about my research that brings the title of A Study of Customer Preferences, True Product Attributes and Customer Perceived Value Towards Purchase Decision of Growing Medium by Home Gardeners. Presented by me, Angela Trisananda Kusuma, from School of Business and Management ITB with the supervisor, Bunurani Kusumamati. This presentation will be divided into these eight sections, starting with the background and problem statement, research question and objectives, business description, theoretical foundation, conceptual framework, methodology, findings, and end it with the conclusion and recommendations. Let's begin with the, pers with the first part of my thesis that becomes the root of the whole research. So it started when it went through the journal, books, and article studies. I found out some phenomena also the opportunities during COVID-19 pandemic that affected people's psychological and physical well-being. But later, these effects drove people to try their new hobbies. And one of the biggest new things that people do is home gardening. It is also shown that 40.52% of people in Indonesia had more plants during the pandemic, based on the survey done by Afrianto in 2021. However, as the early gardeners, the survey also found that 70% of the millennials, which are also the new segment that is entering home gardening, are worried about keeping their host plants alive, adding that almost 52% of home gardeners feels that choosing the right plant component is becoming their obstacle. And growing mediums, as one of the most important plant components, have a large variety that make early gardeners confused to choose. As for product context, growing medium is the material where the plants are grown and really affects plant growth. It serves as a water reservoir for plants, gives nutrients, and provides cases exchanges between plants and roots. Hereby, from several studies, it is summarized that to comprehend how internal cues potentially influence customer purchase decision, however, there is a very limited research about purchase decision in home gardening, specifically in growing medium purchase decision. This limitation will definitely limit Satu Bumi as the new growing medium brand to explore the important parts that Satu Bumi have to focus on when marketing and strategizing the products. Next, here's the formulation of the research question and objectives for this study, which are to determine the factors that affect purchase decision of growing medium by identifying the product attributes and the customer perceived value to be solved by product and marketing strategy for the company. Moving on to the business overview of my company, the name is Satu Bumi. It is a company that aims to help home gardeners who have limited planting experience by providing pro growing medium that have a great mixture of soil and nutrient sources from big soldier fly and fertilizers and premium soil to enhance the land fertility. We're currently on TRL9 and have just deployed the product in the market. By this point, there are four main theoretical foundations that will be used to find out the relevant research result. The first one, there's a foundation of customer preferences, which are the factors that affect people's tendency in purchasing a product. And not only limited to product-related characteristics, it becomes a customer intention factor to purchase a product. Second, there's a product attributes foundation, Attribute shared means the product characteristic that attach into a product. It is divided into two categories, namely intrinsic and extrinsic attributes. Uh, and the third one is the customer perceived value, which is the customer evaluation towards product value, which in this study referred to the research done by Aulia in 2016 that will be divided into three dimensions, which are product related value, social related value, and personal related value. Most importantly, the purchase decision. It is defined as a series of choices for the customers before making a purchase, which begins when they are willing to meet a need, and it is believed that consumer will fall into the brands that best meet their needs. And these are the prior research that related to each attribute so where purchase decision has been done in related industries such as the organic fertilizer studies. And if this one it is showing the prior research about the relation of customer perceived value towards purchase decisions. Moving on to the conceptual framework that is shown in the slide. I will be analyzing six product attributes and three dimensions of customer perceived values for home gardeners. From this conceptual frameworks and journal study, there are nine hypotheses being developed. Hypothesis one, two, three, four, five, and six are predicted about the positive impact between each product attributes on purchase decision. And hypothesis seven, eight, and nine predicted three dimension of perceived value that will have positive impact on purchase decision. 
Finally, to gather and analyze the data, I'll be using the quantitative approach through online-based questionnaires derived in Bahasa Indonesia to ensure the convenience of the survey for all respondents. For the population and sample, I'm targeting individuals between 17 to 56 years old that are domiciled in Jakarta, Bogor, Depok, Tangerang, Bekasi, and Bandung, and have ever purchased growing medium product from brand in farm with a minimum number of 200 samples. The sampling techniques used in this study are non-probability with judgmental or purposive sampling. Later, when the data is gathered, the hypothesis will be tested through the PLS time analysis. And before that, it is also going to be tested to check the validity, reliability, collinearity test, also with the descriptive analysis. And from the research here, these are the hypothesis findings from the nine hypotheses. The first one, there is a positive impact between product quality and the purchase decision. The hypothesis is accepted, moreover, the influence is significant. Hypothesis two, there is a positive impact between packaging and purchase decision. The hypothesis is accepted and the influence is significant. Number three, the hypothesis three, there is a positive impact between material composition and also purchase decision. And this hypothesis is uh, accepted, but the influence is not significant. Hypothesis four, there is a positive impact between usage instruction and purchase decision. The hypothesis also accepted with the significant influence. Hypothesis five, there is a positive impact between price and purchase decision. This hypothesis is accepted. However, the influence is not significant. And the, the hypothesis six, there's a positive impact between brand name and purchase decision. The research found out if this hypothesis is rejected and the influence is not significant. Hypothesis seven, there's a positive impact on between uh, product related value and customer purchase decision, this hypothesis is accepted and the influence is significant. Hypothesis eight, social related value has a positive impact on customer purchase, purchase decision. The hypothesis uh, is uh, accepted and the influence is significant. Hypothesis nine, personal related value has a positive impact on customer purchase decision. This hypothesis is rejected and the influence is not significant. Uh, and these are uh, the conclusion for uh, the research. From the research question one, what are the product attributes preferences that influence the home gardener's purchase decision towards growing medium products? There are six product attributes that are positively influenced the purchase decision. The first one, product quality. Second one, packaging. The third one, material composition. The fourth one, usage instruction. And the fifth one is the price. The significantly influenced attributes are product quality, packaging, and usage instruction. And the insignificant influence is the matter, are the material composition and the price. And for the research question two, what are the customer perceived values that influence home gardeners purchase decision towards growing medium products? There are two customer perceived values. The first one, product related and social related. And those two perceived values are significantly influenced. So uh, what, what are the recommendations that could be concluded from this research? The first one, conduct more product development to test the product quality. The second recommendation is to explore additional nutrition and compositioning other than black soldier fly leftovers to add more nutrients into the product. The third recommendation, to design a packaging that could ease the product usage. For example, by having the pot shape packaging, also the, having the, pots, uh, the spot cap in the packaging, etc. And uh, the, the first recommendation is to craft easy to swallow usage instruction on the product package or packaging that consists of the dosage form and the usage time information. The fifth is that doing routine product quality control to check the quality consistency. And the sixth recommendation is to optimize worth of most marketing to utilize the social related values. For example, by crafting the testimonial marketing from the trusted home gardeners to utilize more trust from the customer to purchase Satubumi Growing Medium products. And that is all from my presentation of this research for this international conference. That's all from me. Thank you so much for the attention.